Hello and welcome to Krachwerke. So I feel like I have made it. I am now on my way. This is it. Only, you know, the stars are the limit. Um, Donner has sent me four pedals to demo review. So yeah, I can keep them and all that. So I don't know about the bias thing. I don't think I will be. Anyway, we'll see. Um, so I'm just going to do an unboxing of these because I need to get a start. I have a suspicion what I'll be doing is I'll do an unboxing video for each because the packaging and stuff look a little bit different from the usual. Um, and then I'll do a bit more in-depth review of each. And I've been wanting to build a new pedal board, a smaller pedal board. Um, and I think I use these as a base. Um, so nothing to do but start. So I just took the first one off the pack. So this is the Donner Circle Looper Guitar Effect Pedal New Made in China EC12989. Um, circle Looper. So it says special box. Special box. Okay, USB cable. These little micro USB, I don't I hate those things. Um, really nicely packaged. Kind of has its own little stuff. Sorry, I don't really do un unpacking videos, so excuse me. Um, this is the pedal. Pretty. It's actually very pretty. It's got little rubber feet, um, rubber feet on the back. It has the um, screws nicely flush. How many inputs? External control input, input for left and right. So this is a looper. And from what I can see, a little bit more uh, involved looper than just, you know, um, record, um, overdub, playback, stop, delete, um, left and right, in and out, record, dub, and tap, um, stop, play, clear. Um, merger, control, hold for delete. Ooh. Memory level, fade out. Okay, so I've got no idea how to use this. But I was looking for a looper. I was looking for a different looper. I'm actually using my Zoom Multifix pedal for looping at the moment. Uh, what else is in the box? Um, I wish people wouldn't get so excited about stickers because they're just really, at the end of the day, landfill most of the time. So two stickers. Uh, join Donner Vine program. Um, Vine program. I hope that's not Vine as in, you know, precursor to TikTok. <laughs> uh, double foot switch looper pedal owner's manual. This is quite a extensive we um owner's manual i've got a suspicion you're gonna have to do some rtfming with this one 44 kilohertz 24-bit high quality looper and drum machine up to four minutes of recording time per each track 40 preset slots and 160 minutes total recording capacity 100 different drum grooves from 10 unique styles of, uh, of music 10 types of metronome settings to choose from. External, external control function supports external foot switch control, has to be purchased separately. Supports import export uh, of recordings via USB with editing software. The detail of recording is displayed by the progress bar on the screen. Separate foot switch for controlling looper and drum machine. Recording saved automatically even after circle loop is powered off. Uh, memory looper saving mode. Uh, 
Fuck knows. I'm gonna have to read the fucking manual on this thing. <sighs> looper, looper LED. It's got a fade out function. Obviously, record the playback and dub. Undo. Here's a lovely spelling mistake. Output let and output right. This is my left hand and this is my right hand. There is a spelling mistake on the little LCD photo that they have. It's not undo, it's updo. So I can updo whatever came in on the let output. Shit. Okay, well, there you go. This is uh, fairly decent. It looks and feels really good. Um, it feels silk screened. I am not, see, I'm kind of weirded out lately. The more I've been building pedals, the more I've been looking at pedals and putting pedal boards together, the more you go like, why aren't they standardizing certain things? Like, especially with digital pedals, where you're running off a PCB uh, that can be kind of fashioned in many different ways, you would think that slowly but surely we start trending towards putting all the inputs at the front, um, that if we have a nice flat bottom um, and they were smart enough to put, um, to recess the screws, why did they put the feet on? You know, if you want the feet, you should be able to put them on because most people just Velcro stuff. So you need that really flat back. But anyway, that's me starting to bet your mono already. Um, anyway, that is a quick unboxing of the D -D 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 Donner. Can't wait to try this thing, actually, because I've been really, really been looking for a, a stereo capable looper. Um, that has some sort of a display of progress and stuff like that. Um, and for the new board that I am going to be building, that is definitely a requirement. So I honestly can't wait to get this guy up and running and see what it has. And yes, just stay tuned because I'll do my best to get these done as soon as possible. But as you can see with this one, I will most likely have to read the manual before I can do anything with it. <laughs> Anyway, that is the unboxing of the Donner, excuse me, Circle Looper Guitar Effect pedal, which has an updo instead of an undo. Thank you.